Hello guys, it is Howdy Zach here, and today I'm going to show you how to install mods like cars, objects, planes, and maps into Beam NG Drive. So, why am I doing this when, when you open up Beam NG Drive, there's an Add Mods button right there? Well, it turns out if you click the Add Mod button, it brings you to a separate page instead of when the old version, it used to bring you into like a separate menu type thing where you can just drag the mods in and, and like import them in. But that's gone now and they haven't updated their website, so yeah. So obviously you want to go get your car mod or download a car or a plane or a map or an object. And I will leave this link in the description. It is modsdownload.com slash bmng drive mods. It has tons of different mods for tons of different games like Farm Simulator, Steam, GTA 5, Omsi, don't know what that is. But you want to go to like near the top and then it'll say BMNG drive mods, cars, maps, other and planes. So I'm going to show you how to do cars and I'll tell you how to do maps and you know objects when we're installing the car file. You just want to like find whatever. I'll do the BMNG the BMW 5251 Drift. I know you want to do is click download. It'll open up in a new link and it'll say free download. I'll click that. It'll open up a new page and you just want to X out of it. Then download file and it should just start to download. So once your file is downloaded, it should be a dot zip. You just want to go and drag it onto your desktop so you know where it is. And then you want to X out of your browser. Then you want to go into Steam and right click on the BeamNG Drive thing and then go to properties then local files and browse local files now once you're in here there'll be a ton of stuff you want to look for the one called content and double click that now if you're going to install a map you want to go into levels and drop the file in here but if you're going to install vehicles like the planes or objects or you know cars you just double click this one and it'll have ones that you've either added or ones that just came with the game and all you want to do is to close down these and drag it in and then as you see if you open it it should go vehicles first like a vehicles folder then the name and then a ton of different stuff just like you know tire wall which is in the game already and yeah so then if you go into the game you should press play free room then you go to grid map or whatever map you really want to and you'll find it somewhere in this file I can't like look because I have tons of them. Sometimes it doesn't have a picture like this or that or most of the downloaded cars that I have but it will still work like say the McLaren it doesn't have a picture just click on it and replace the current and it will spawn in and it'll have a picture well it'll have itself. And so yeah guys if you liked it you know hit the like button if you didn't like it dislike button if you're having problems you know comment them or go to a form i'm pretty sure the website you download it from has a form on it to like try help you or comments on the specific file you're trying to install but yeah goodbye